Let's take a look at, at the quote. Um, mm -hmm. Talking about him missing time and, and uh, you know, he's had the knee problems, the ankle problems this year. I think a lot of people don't understand that when I sit out, it's not because of this year. I'm thinking about long term. I don't want to be in my meetings all sore or be at my son's graduation all sore just because of something I did in the past. So that uh, created all kind of reaction. And uh, just a short time ago in Toronto, Rachel Nichols talked to Derrick Rose about his comments. Take issue with what he said? Of course I do. That was stupid. <clears throat> Derrick Rose is a great player. He's a great kid. Love his mom. That was stupid. You know, Ernie, we're so blessed. I limp around, but I go home to a big old mansion. When I go home, it's a big old house. And I got, what the, I don't even know how the sheets, I got good sheets. I don't know the thread count, but they good. Probably. I got a big old car. I never <laughs> have to worry about my bills. There are pros and cons to what we do for a living. Derrick Rose is making $20 million a year. He got a couple bad knees. That's disrespectful to maids, people who are in the army, who go out and kill people and get killed, got no arms and no legs. And listen, as much as I like Derrick Rose, that was just flat out stupid. Did this bring his commitment in question in, in either of your minds? I agree with Chuck a little bit. Does it bring his commitment to that team in, into question? I don't know about that, but, you, you know, just I was taught that if you can walk, you can play. Uh, imagine this, Kevin McHale, you see how he oh, yeah. walked? Phil Jackson, you see how he walked? You see how Chuck walked? You see how I walked? But guess what? It was worth it. Yeah, I walked. It was worth it. It was worth it. So, you, you know, when you, when you say comments like that, it sort of makes you look soft. But, you know, like he said, he can only be himself. And if that's the way he feels, that's the way he feels. But me personally, mm -hmm. if I could walk, I could play. Well, I, I think that the context should have been more of I – the reason I sit out games now is to help us win a championship. Thank you. And then the second part of that is, and that's also going to benefit me later on in my career and after basketball. But to precede it by it's going to help you first after basketball leads you to believe that maybe when you were hurt last year and everyone says, or the two years ago, that you could have played. So you, you leave all the speculation. The reason why Tim Duncan sits out and Manuel Ginobili sits out and Parker sits out is because they're winning championships. And yes, it will help them in the long run. But basketball is not like football either, Ernie, where there's a difference between a concussion and a sprained ankle. Like you sit out games for concussion with football guys have, mm -hmm. or, or even uh, Nick uh, Vucevic had last yeah. year. Okay, cool. We understand that. That's, that's lifelong. That could be more than just basketball. But, you know, they have let me ACL. Say this, uh, they, have, they have operations for things that for, for basketball players. I walk around and I limp and y'all make fun of the way I walk. Yes, but it was worth it, right? Hold on. I wouldn't change anything exactly. about my life, man. Me either. I, listen, I grew up in Leeds, Alabama in the projects. I bought my mom a house. I bought my grandmother a house. I bought my brothers a house. I wouldn't change anything about my life. Yeah, but I, I'll give him a little bit of benefit of the doubt in the context that he said. You know, we're taking a, you know, a, a part of a quote and not a whole thought process. So maybe he did mean that, but just didn't express it the right way. Because I don't think as an MVP that you could, you could be soft. I don't think yeah. as an MVP. But, 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 but you, I heard, you heard what he said to Rachel, no, too, no, though. No, no, he, t t see, that's my point, Ernie. Yeah. The problem I have, first mm -hmm. of all, Sometimes we say things that you want to go back. He had a chance to clean it up with Rachel. But said, if you don't understand, yeah. I don't really care. Yeah, and I know. So, that's so that's what I have a problem with even more. I'm going to give him the benefit of the doubt because an MVP can't be, have a, a low threshold of pain. It's impossible.